Welcome back, everyone, to episode 331 of our Let's Play to reform the Taiyi sect. I think we dealt with this trade uh, last time, if I'm not mistaken. I'm going to double check just to make sure, but I think we did. Make sure all is good there. Uh, BE has been working on using some of the... Uh, yeah, we did this already. Uh, BE has been working on uh, some of the more intense tags. So we'll see. That should help uh, improve his power quite a lot. Uh, we clearly are still getting... Uh, whoops. Uh, looks like it's going to the right person. Okay. Uh, nope, it's not. <laughs> oh, no, yeah, it is. Okay, good. Thought it went to uh, the other person for a second. Uh, we are still getting, uh, as you can tell, obsession gems. Uh, we're still doing derivative calculation with this guy until we uh, tell him adios. Yadogami. He's out here picking. Um, I thought we finished all this stuff last episode, but maybe I cut it short or something. Anyway, uh, we're out at Lake Jade Stone to get that. Uh, let's see. That one does give us some memorial time. So, 264, Autumn 22. Okay, about a year. Alright. And, uh, let's see. We do have some stuff in winter, but it's midway through, so... We've got a bit of time to ourselves here. Uh, Chi could probably head back out and continue to age. 4,300 years isn't quite enough here. Uh, Li Yu is going to continue to cultivate. She is almost halfway there to the Gate of Life. Uh, looks like, yeah, two million to go. Uh, she is a little bit slow at it. She is on the battle branch. I guess we could switch that. Just have to make sure that we uh, switch her back, right? This is the this is the cultivation branch, man. No one no one's even in here anymore. <laughs> this is the main branch originally. Now it's sub branch. Crazy how that goes. We do have quite a few spirit roots, too. Uh, at some point, you may have to just start getting rid of these. Uh, no one needs any right now, I'm pretty sure. They're just taking up too, too much space, you know? Yeah, trees are devouring the bodies, that's right. What do you mean you lost? A wolf might uh, perish. trees here. Yeah, I looked uh, once again uh, off stream for that um, that natural law that we had, the uh, Chant of Dwelling Dragon, I think it was, or something like that. Rayanne picked it up. Still couldn't spot it. So I have to assume it's like some kind of just buff that he gets. Something in here. Um, yeah, who knows? Dwelling Dragon, maybe it has something to do with, like, a barrier or something like that. Chi regeneration, perhaps. 
So I guess Rayan is just stronger now? <laughs> Game isn't uh, too clear on it. It'd be nice if it, you know, showed us what it was, but I can't, I cannot find it. Uh, it might be in a different area altogether from the manuals, but I don't know where it would be then. I didn't see any pluses or anything, like when I was looking at his... Um, yeah, like these numbers, I didn't see any pluses. Then again, we don't really know what they were beforehand either. Um, same thing in here. It looks just like it always has, so... Uh, any number of these things might be just different. Who knows? Uh, may look it up one day, but I'm not. I'm not too worried about it. Um, it doesn't appear to be a manual, and it's not a law either. So my assumption is uh, we can't make use of it really. Um, so I guess that's cool, though. I mean, you get a. A benefit then from uh, uh, occasionally, I guess, if you're cultivating uh, next to one of these trees. So that's pretty interesting. Probably get more of those uh, going on here uh, as we continue to grow these trees. Uh, unsuitable temperature, yeah, too cold. Surprised this tree hasn't complained yet. Let's see what that does. Citra dude dis has decided to make this his spot, which is fine. His cultivation doesn't do anything, as far as I know. Alright. So let's see what he was able to get. I think, uh... Well, wait, wait, what are we looking for here, actually? Wraith Breath. Uh, yeah, that's right. That's what we're looking for. Yep. Senseless Skin. This one we're going to do, yeah, Lunar Frost Flash, yep. Darn. <laughs> Gave us quite a lot. I was thinking maybe it would just finish it for us, but... No luck today. No luck today. I almost clicked that. It would have warned me, like, hey, are you sure you want to add this? <laughs> so we're good. Uh, yet again, we could do Lunar Frost over here, too. Probably make a lot of sense. Senseless. Or is it senseless? Yeah. I mean, we do leave us uh, two, two slots left for things. Um, I don't think, do we don't actually need Enhanced Flesh, right? We were just doing it because it's, like, beneficial, so. Maybe if we find three tags that do better things, maybe we'd just avoid even Enhanced Flesh as well. That's definitely a possibility. Uh, for now, let's try to finish that Senseless Skin, uh, and you can start on the Lunar stuff. Now, I think... Earth, fire, metal. Wow, okay. Let's take care of those now before I get thinking. But I, I think... Um, well, let me just do what I just said. Acarescence. Um, also want to make sure these are, are not the Demonia Temple. We don't care about the Demonia Temple, but... They've already been conquered. 
And I figured the Demonia Temple, honestly, when I set out to do that one, I figured they would be one of the harder ones. Uh, it seems like maybe they're one of the easier ones, so not having to deal with an enemy formation is kind of nice. Kind of nice. I was thinking about it, though, like, okay, they killed us with, uh, you know, a bunch of AoE spells, right? Not even a bunch, just, it was just one that they managed to use periodically. Uh, why can't we do the same? Is what I was thinking of, too. So, kind of lends even more credence, perhaps, to having, like, a, a wood formation leader. Uh, you know, those guys are good at, you know, everything, really. I mean, they're good at battle, they can do spells too, um, so they're just kind of all around generalists, and we do have Zhang who is, uh, you know, who has four artifacts on her too, it's obviously not quite as strong as Tanetta's, but then again, you're not going to be killing them anytime soon anyway, right, with those four artifacts, but we could load you up with a bunch of AoE spells, you know, uh, as a wood cultivator, and it wouldn't it wouldn't cost you that much, is the thing. In fact, I think you're. Uh, in fact, I think we would get a uh, a bonus. I think it would be connective for a lot of those spells. You know, spell slinging manuals. So something I was thinking about uh, might make might make sense to have Zheng eat some uh, spirit seeds. She is cultivating. Uh, she does have quite a quite a lot of stamina still, but down to seven of them. Uh, let's eat like a couple. We don't need that many, so that'll help her out. Is there anything else she can do for a bit of of a bit of chi? She has uh, ninety percent in sun pill. I think that's good. I think it's okay. Obviously, as she cultivates indefinitely, uh, she will gain a little bit of extra chi over time. Uh, oh, yeah. So, we were looking at the physical tags, I think. Yeah, it says SB bonus. And I have a, I left a question mark there because I'm pretty... I can't remember. I, I think I couldn't take down the tag properly. So, let's try out solar on the bone. And we'll assume that it's a damage thing. So I'm going to put it on one of the attacking... Uh, the mixed element arms. Our offensive arms. Right here. Oh, right. Uh, no, right there it is. Yeah, so increases the secret body power drastically. Yeah, so we definitely want that on there. Let's uh, update this. Uh, yeah. That's a really, a really good one. So, yeah, let's put that on. Let's put that on all of the bones. So we've already got it there, of course. Um, uh, yep. Like, I'm wondering even if Psychic Bone should be on here, you know? I'm wondering if we'll eventually remove that, too, because it's just secret body attack accuracy by a small amount. Like, I don't, I don't think that's actually that good. Maybe... Oh, nice, I got a Phoenix. Maybe we'll end up purging that, too, in the future. Possible. Very possible. Uh, we do have our dishes now, too. Uh, we did finish uh, that up, I believe, in the last episode. Um, let's cancel this weather, because I want to see... I think one of them was still... I think this one was still uh, not very auspicious, even under normal conditions. Yeah. This one is still a problem. Is it just because... 
No, it's because there's, yeah, the spirit wood vase here. Right, right, right. I wonder if I move it... Let's see, what's the element look like here? Yeah, so it's... Hmm. If I move it right here, it might disturb the wood water vat, but maybe it won't. Let's Let's try it out. I mean, a bit of wood energy here uh, wouldn't be too problematic for the wood water vat. So maybe this would be a good, uh, good compromise. Plus, it would look a little bit maybe nicer. Nicer kitchen. Obviously, we're using the Phoenix Wood just because it's going to generate a lot of element. Uh, I don't know. I'm, I'm assuming the Phoenix Wood generates more element than... Uh, wait, why was it on fire? Anyway, it's good now. Um, yeah, somehow people are getting over here when they shouldn't. Earthquake. Somehow people are getting back here when they shouldn't. I'll try to put it up one more time, but if it's still if it's still a problem, we'll have to we'll have to probably redesign how this room works a little bit. Which is unfortunate. Okay, good job. Good job. These guys are really smart. Try that one next. Oh, uh, okay. We have a barbarous toxic. It looks like a bull. Onyx and um Meow oh cat. Send him BE there too, just because uh he might get hit a little bit, which will give him uh painful memories, hopefully. Perhaps. There, Sutra. Could you also kill this one, too? Could get a cat soul gem out of this. Obviously, also, you can get the... the nice, uh, hide. The purple hide. We did get a bit of that recently. Uh, does not look like we're that lucky this time. No big deal. That is the reason, by the way, if you're playing in a larger map, uh, why you might want to keep... Like, if there's, like, a monster over here that, that's naturally formed, and it's, like, way far away from your base, uh, it makes a lot of sense to leave them uh, so they can become primordial spirits on their own. It's just extra, extra chances... Uh, at better rewards, you know? Free stuff. When you go to kill them. Um, uh, we do not have that option, though. So we are at the mercy of the game sending us random beasts like that, really. 
Um, yeah, this looks okay to me. Uh, obviously, uh, eventually we'll get rid of this uh, white scale for something else. It's a bit more kosher, but... I think this is okay. Yeah, we'll definitely want to clear out the spirit wood, even though it is thematically uh, good to have it here. Um, there's no reason not to have uh, greater chi regeneration or chi uh, gathering uh, onto the uh, the chi gathering array. Of course, it's the whole purpose. <laughs> That's the whole reason it exists is to gather the chi into that one spot. Um, yep, and we do have our blocks being built now too. We'll queue up cotton um, on the loom later. We were kind of in the process of rebuilding uh, some of our furniture in here to make this room a little bit nicer. Um, I'm not sure if I actually want to continue that. Uh, the problem is, it seems like this workshop gets demolished quite often. <laughs> it is one of our bigger buildings where some people are. Phoenix seems to like uh, destroying it for some reason. So I'm not actually sure it's a good idea to do that. Uh, then again, we do have plenty of materials. Except for dark steel. And I think you have to use dark steel for the... Because I don't think there's... Let's double check. Yeah, it's either iron or dark steel. Dark steel is a little bit uncommon. I mean, we, we would have to go out and farm, farm it a bit. We do have plenty, but it's like, if we start to use up a lot of it, then it's going to become a problem. Not a problem, but like a nuisance. Because uh, I think this is the only way to get it right here. Uh, some of the sects might sell it, though. Like, do you guys actually sell? No. I don't sell the dark steel itself. Some of the, One of them might, though. Maybe we'll look for that next time. If someone's got a huge stash of it that they always have up for sale, then, then yeah, I'd consider it at that point. So we'll speed up the game. Uh, some guy, too, is cultivating. Uh, yeah, actually, he's going to hit it very shortly. He's in the practice branch right now, too. Uh, we need to make sure... Yeah, he's still got, actually, a lot of learning to do. Looking for power in this section is kind of, <laughs> it's kind of, doesn't work that well. Oh, wow, we missed the compass doctrine. Whoops. That was a mistake. Yeah, we definitely missed quite a few things uh, this round. We were kind of rushing it. I didn't really pay attention too much to him. look for anything that's connective. Uh, or plane. I'll take that too. A little bit interesting when Liu becomes a statue, too. Um, assuming she succeeds, of course, which she should. Um, I guess she'll be a elementless statue. So we could put that technically anywhere. We don't have to worry about its impact on the environment whatsoever. 
and it would be a feng shui building, but I guess, but it wouldn't have any element to come into it, so it wouldn't really, it would always be auspicious, as far as I know. Uh, interestingly, these are actually auspicious right now. Is it just that they like to be near others of each of the same type? Because these are just slightly. Hmm. It wouldn't make a lot of sense, though. It's a feng shui building, so it should like the fact that there's wood around here, but obviously don't want to re we don't really want to put wood here. Maybe we should, though. That would give uh, enemies more targets when they appear on the map. You notice uh, sometimes they'll just start attacking like our lights and stuff. Uh, they could potentially, I guess, attack these mortal bodies instead. So it make, might make some sense to have a couple stands just to have a short range uh, element come into these. Should get completely wiped out by the time that you get to the center over here. So maybe that makes sense. Um, this is First Cat. First Cat's been, uh, he's been a str a struggling here, so... Um, not looking too good so far. Seems like he's gonna continue that. He's already done with that one. Um, uh, wiping that delighted out. Yep. I don't know. First cat doesn't really know what he's doing right now. A bit confused. Uh, right. Uh, we've been working on this too. Uh, I think it was two flags that we had in here. Because of this. Yeah. Uh, two banners, right? <laughs> two. Yeah, we've... We've uh, already learned our lesson here. I think it... Oh, it's under... Wait, no. It's under... I thought it was under decoration. Scenery, right? Yeah, okay. So, we're going to try to burn this thing, actually. We have jade flooring under here too, so we might have to use uh, fire, fire stuff too. It is slightly ominous now, so uh, normally I would say that's bad, but in this case, it's exactly what we want. So uh, we'll keep this one, I guess. I'm not sure. In some ways it's better, in some ways it's worse. This one seems decent too, 70 power. And then uh, we'll try to make some more of these. Continue our experiment. I, I'm starting to wonder if they buffed the chance at that, because uh, <laughs> when I, uh, when you ever first start a game, it's like, man, you're just praying for those things to happen. It seems like we just get them all the time. Um, starting to wonder if they buffed that. Send uh, Long Shen instead, I guess. He can be kind of our gopher while we're So somehow I made this crafting table ominous and somehow now we're blessed. Like, what? What is that? What's that about? Uh, this is not a room, right? No, it's not. Now it is. Uh, incompatible. Why? 
it's still next to the stove. Oh, maybe it's not enough element now. Wow, it must be like right on the edge. Hmm. That's tough. How do we... How do we get just a little bit more? Um, we could put it right here, but then it should make this... Regular auspicious again. Hmm. Uh, right here? But then, yeah, that would actually be worse for everyone. I have no other spots to put this stuff. Um, I mean, we could try to play around with other uh, physical objects here. Or, oh, actually... That might be the solution right there. That is the solution. Uh, it looks really dumb, though. <laughs> So walls obviously generate the element out just one tile. And so uh, that's enough to get it through, but it this 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 is functional. But it's one of those cases where the form is kind of bothering me, you know. I'm usually a function over form type guy, but I don't know if my OCD can take that one. So uh, let's see, we do have sculptures. This one's about to fall off. Let's see, did we get two stacks? One stack. No, we only did get one. Um, oh, what are we? We're looking for climbing. Okay, we're done with watching boulders. Uh, does not look like we got any climbing. So, we did not get any delighted too. So we might be losing that soon. Anyway, it doesn't matter if we think on it or not. It's going to take whatever your highest timer is. So if we don't get a new delighted here, it's just gone um, in a couple rounds. So I think we can hold out just one more round on the sculptures. We'll have to think on it next round. So we'll go for there, but it's not looking good for second cat either. So second, second cat struggling a bit too. Our fire chicken is growing up. Um, that was another thing that we, or I kind of thought about after our uh, f failure too was this guy might be able to at least help a little bit with fuse. So once in a 10 minute, you know, type cooldown, but, um, let's see, Tanetta can grab that. I think on the rabbit too. Yeah, he has tranquil and climbing right now, so, oh yeah, he does have gems too, right? So he's good to go. Uh, did we get a bonus gems or no? Okay. So we have to think on gems no matter what. We are still looking for the watching boulder. Um, let's see. Sculptures would be nice. We could probably keep this thunder though too. Uh, this ecstatic's probably gonna drop off, but let's keep keep the delighted here too as well. <laughs> Give us some options. Terrified's reasonably interesting too, but all right, yeah, that's right. So rabbit is good with tranquil climbing and gems. Nice. Head of Doom also killed the Phoenix. Apparently, the Phoenix is visiting everyone this year. Christmas in in fall, basically. Although, actually, that's the winner now. Hmm. Alright. All 
these are here. We have to augment all of them. Speaking of which, let's bring in some soul gems, shall we? Slightly ominous, and the room itself should still be uh, positive. It's very uh, funny how that works. <laughs> I think it's based on the artifact crafting table, so I guess we'll find out. I mean, that's why we're doing this is to test, right? That is why we're doing it. Yeah, some guy's getting close. Um, let's have him uh, learn some more stuff. Here he still has plenty to go. Let's do agility. down to 32 so he's getting getting a little bit lower now yeah he, he's not gonna get that far this time we, we definitely messed up this round for sure but um should be able to get at least a few rounds i would think Uh, be uh, he's still working on it yeah we did queue up quite a lot so we'll have to look at him uh, probably probably next episode really uh lee you is there any inspiration that you have oh you have quite a lot too actually let's give you max spell first and then let's make sure that lee you has some of the stuff Like, um, reverse a cycle. Okay, she must have already learned that one. Vitality. Okay, so I guess she's learned quite a lot of the spell stuff already. Uh, let's look for protection then. Yeah, she could pick up... The interesting part about her is, uh, being elementless is she can pick up every manual, really. So... Uh, an advantage. She doesn't get any benefit from being uh, connective, but I think the the counteractive stuff is way worse than the connective bonus, you know what I mean? It's like triple the amount, whereas like connective just gives you like a 25% discount, you know? <laughs> Pretty one-sided. Uh, let's see. That's quite a lot of uh, inspiration that she had. Hmm. 
Might need someone else to take over uh, some of the supporter duties in the sect. I know we've been giving some of that to Ja, but might be a good idea to have someone else earmarked too. This is usually what it's like with derivative. I'm I'm starting to think, yeah, I don't think you can use derivative to get like the Phoenix and stuff. Uh, maybe you can, and it's just a really low chance. Uh, we're, we might be getting unlucky, but we're about to use derivative calculation another hundred times or so. If we don't get any of the three out of it, probably safe to say that uh, derivative calculation can't be used here. Probably. second wave of people is coming in too. Yeah. I don't think we can actually send um yeah, we have to keep this on watch because no one's going to help us here. It's just us. So that other place uh, is going to have to get help from other people beyond, uh, you know, the 600 or so that we give off the bat. Let's have Jaw do it instead so that Liu can focus on uh, cultivation. It appears as though she's going faster. It's hard to tell. I have to use like a stopwatch or something. It should be better though. Crazy bull. Oh. <laughs> All right. Yeah, I would say they definitely are crazy for doing this. Free inspiration on Tanetta is good. What's she up to now? Seven. Uh, 175. Okay. Yeah, I feel like, uh, Tineta, there's quite a lot of things that we'd want to learn now. I mean, if we could get some spell power rolling, we could actually maybe even learn some of the AoE spells on Tineta, too, maybe. Um. So, yeah. Tineta, I assume, has already received the origin buff, though. So he, she can't really drop her attainment any further um i'm not sure that's the case i kind of wonder if it is just the fact that she wasn't at the highest level i don't really know if i want to test it right now <laughs> how much do we have 26 i mean we could i guess I suppose let's look through here see if anyone else is stocking them we could pick up a torch elixir we can do that whenever. <laughs> I 
Oh, uh, oh, it's dark steel offcut. Never mind. I was gonna say uh, we we're also looking for dark steel ore, but it's just the offcut. Not exactly the same thing. Uh, might as well pick up the free parasol timber. Oh. Right, this is less expensive than I thought. Oh, maybe not that much. Okay. So that was purple cloud. With divine bones, but we don't—we don't really need those. We get plenty of those every year from Demonia. Honestly, we don't even need those. Uh, it does reduce your attainment though, so actually we could have Tanetta eat a few of those since she's trying to get less attainment. So that'll probably be what we do. Sounds pretty reasonable to me. I think these things have a twenty percent resistance, if I'm not mistaken, though. So we can't just spam them. Could probably have like five though. After that it starts to fall off pretty hard in effectiveness. Maybe six. Oh, look at that. Fortune seed. Nice. Uh, yeah, we will take that off your hands. Let's just get rid of all of our clothes. In fact, we might even get rid of... Eh, hold off. Some of this uh, dragon clothing is about to burn down. The phoenix has uh, caused a lot of chaos. Definitely a good idea to protect your valuables by putting them on stands. Or at least, you know, protect them as much as you can, right? I think they will take these these hides. So we'll do that. Okay, we should be uh, nowhere close to it. I wonder how much they do charge for these. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, these things are pretty valuable for sure. Looks like they recognize that. Well, that's a lot. Okay. Nice. The deal is done indeed. Seven slaughtering has. Do a bunch of resonance. We might need that. If we're feeling lazy, we can just buy some Anguish Soul Gems, too, of course. And you guys never have anything. Except for food. like BE's finished uh, some of his work. Not looking good so far, though. There's one. It's Wraith Breath. And everyone is at one of the trees. Good. Now that we know that we can get, like, natural laws, whatever they are. That makes sense. Nice. Mortal Destiny Fair. 
Uh, it's 50, well, maybe not quite 50 soul gems, but it's like 30. <laughs> um, let's have Phoenix go and talk to them. Uh, it used to be Jun Wan's job. Uh, she's living out her years. Uh, retired somewhere in the hills. Sewing speed. Probably end up eating this thing. Need to um, make sure we remember that Jing should eat that one first and then eat one of these. Speaking of which, actually, Jing is coming up. Um, so she should be done. Yep, she's bursting. So we can have her eat. Uh, yeah, we ac actually, we could even have her eat it right now. Uh, this thing has a lot of Ling Chi in it, though. Let's try to not make her explode. Start with that. Uh, okay, so we did still get 50. So I guess it is probably just based on your making sure that you send someone at least Primordial Spirit with uh, max charisma, I guess would probably be it. Most likely. So, alright. You can eat that now. She doesn't need to cultivate anymore, so it doesn't matter if her mental state gets ruined now. Uh-huh. Have another one. Looks like you can handle one more. Uh, not that one, though. Uh, you can eat that one. Pretty good. We could probably even do one more. What does she have equipped right now? Yeah, so she's got cultivation. Oh, she actually already has a base mental state bonus on. That's kind of scary. Uh, we could, yeah, improve it even further, though. Uh, we definitely want to give her... Yeah, the Chi Absorption Efficiency Talisman, I, I believe, does help. If I'm not mistaken. I could be completely wrong about this, but I think it does. And then... She still has 39 million, but she doesn't have anything else to learn, so that's good. We could give her... So that's the water spirit root. A little bit of extra inspiration. Yeah, it's not the full one. Uh, the full ones are coming up, but we're still quite a ways away from it. I don't think we'll have the wood one in time. Wood one's still kind of a baby. Actually, it's still complaining about the temperature. I'm surprised it's not popping up anymore. Maybe I told it not to at some point. Hmm. All right, so you could have you could have a Serira equipped. This thing doesn't bother you because yeah, you can have it equipped. You just can't eat it because it gives you a, a million chi. Obviously, you'll explode. But equip is fine. Make sure that we clicked equip. I guess. It's probably a good thing to make sure of. And then, uh, Story Talisman. We'll have to drop temporarily our... Uh, let's drop this one for now. Make sure that's frozen. Uh, actually, we'll also put it on a stand, I think. Right there. Okay. So that'll improve her mental state. She's at 141 while sitting right there, which is way more than she needs. But how much does she have? 
while out in a boot. 190, wait, what? Wait a minute. How much does the Sarira give? All we did was give her a chi absorption of fish. Oh, no, that's right. We did get the story talisman, too. Okay. So, um, this could suck later on, but we could probably eat yet another one of these. Where is she at on those? 27.10. Yeah, so let's try to eat another one. I might end up regretting this, but... Um, okay, all of these are full on chi. Uh, do you have Palm of Absorption? No, you don't. So let's have uh, Ja learn that too. Uh, okay, I think it was this one, right? up to 37.6 now. This is going to be a pretty good golden core. Uh, really sucks that this tree is not going to be ready in time, but it is what it is. Um, Thirty-nine. Oh boy. Yeah, I would say four is probably your your soft cap is what they call it in these video games. If you're not familiar with the term, uh, that's the soft cap is the point where the value per uh, per the uh, sacrifice you have to make is not. Um, it starts to become worth very less. It's it's like basically your soft cap is like you're gonna get most of your benefit at that point, and then if you keep pushing beyond that, you can, but it's just gonna be not maybe necessarily prohibitively costly, but the cost may not be as good as, you know, the reward that you get. So I think that's where we're at, at 35%. Because we only gained... We only gained about 7% medicine resistance there. Um, it was actually quite a lot of chi, though. So maybe the soft cap is a little bit higher. But she's going to have some serious mental state issues uh, if we ever turn off these things. And we'll have to. Obviously, we can't have the story talisman on when we're trying to cultivate. So that's minus 61. Brings her down to 110. Sarira will probably leave at some point. So that's probably another minus 5 or minus 10. Um, and then, so you remove those two things, and then she gets off the cultivation platform because she's getting her her boost right now from the sect should probably have like maybe 15 or 20 mental state or something um, um so you know we we could we could eat one more we could i'm kind of debating it now <laughs> should we eat one more? We do have three made. We should probably make a few more of those. Let's, uh, yeah, let's make a few more. Hmm. While I think about it, I'm going to do Palm of Absorption here. think about that uh you shall have you eaten okay so you have used a few of these divine bones you just eat it i guess so it's kind of nasty what does a divine bone taste like Ugh. she gained uh 10 10 percent 
Yeah, it's hardly even doing anything to her attainment, so. I guess they're a small bonus. Eat one more. She's at 1056. Oh, it was 10. It's not bad. Alright, first cat again. Uh, fog is okay. We actually have it down here already, but it's about to fall off. Um, obviously, we're looking for this instead. Uh, climbing is gone again, unfortunately. So we're back at square one. So I guess it doesn't really make sense to even try to keep the fog going. We don't have any of the red stuff. So we'll just think on that. First cat's uh, at level zero right now. I'm trying to get the last uh, thought in. It does take a while. Obviously, you're looking for very particular things. And the RNG is working against you, basically. South. Good stuff. Uh, we could probably put this one on watch now. Hey, the Flood Dragon. I think that'll be something that we do in the next episode. Uh, so let's go upset that guy. Uh, we want to use Earth Artifacts, I'm fairly sure. Let's just double check. More susceptible to earth damage. Doneta, Doneta. And actually, we may use just two artifacts because the Flood Dragon is even weaker than the Phoenix. I don't want to destroy him too fast that we, you know, don't get any loot, right? So let's just stick with two artifacts uh, in addition to her regular three. Uh, that should 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 negate a bit of her damage. We do have the fire bath tunic on. I think I might just leave that on. Um, it does raise our protection skill. I think I'd rather have the artifact thing, but honestly, we kind of want to temper our damage, like I was just saying, uh, into the flood dragon here. We don't want to kill him too fast. I think that's fine, though. Uh, yep, all of that is okay. So we'll probably just end up using Tanetta, and that's it, I would imagine, during this fight. So, um, Jailun. Jailun is actually still set up for the Flood Dragon, so we'll have to keep that in mind. Uh, Jailun can help too. Uh, is there anything else that we need to prepare? Uh, I know that we need to cancel the rain. Uh, we need to do that three times, so we do have Liu uh, on deck for that. Someone else will have to do that in the future. I don't know who that would be. Could be Jiao. She does actually have the Lu Shu on right now. So yeah, Jiao can take, take that mission over. Forgot that she's not actually out right now, but... Yeah, it might make sense to keep Jiao in the sect now, um... Now that Liu is planning on leaving, so she can kind of take over some of the supporting duties. Uh, I don't think there's anything else we need to do to prepare. Uh, it's just going to come over here and start messing our sect up again. Um, one thing that you can do is remove any excess water that you have on the map. Usually a good idea. I like my pond. I'm not going to touch my pond. But if you had like a bunch of extra water in places that you don't even use in your in your map, good idea to come over uh, and do uh, land shaping just to get rid of that stuff before the flood dragon arrives. Reduces its power. I never nurtured this thing. Whoops. Okay. 
Um, yeah, I think the two fighters will be fine. Uh, the only other thing that, of course, we have to do is send uh, everyone else away. Uh, we do have a couple of things coming up in 10 days or so, but we should be very much finished with the Flood Dragon by then. Uh, so yeah, let's upset this guy. Uh, we'll actually cancel. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't don't actually use the derivative calculation. We'll wait until the Flood Dragon is uh, done with, and then we'll go back to that because we're trying to use that to see if... I don't know if you'll get a second. I doubt you would get a second event, right? That would be kind of weird. Maybe? Could you fight the Flood Dragon and the Phoenix at the same time? <laughs> that would be challenge mode for sure. <laughs> Can you imagine? They would counter each other, though, with their weather effects, wouldn't they? Gosh, that would be weird. Maybe I should just stop thinking about it. <laughs> yep, good job. It's on its way. Uh, oh, there's the 50 people. Uh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's make sure we move these corpses so that they all have a place to stand. I don't know if that'll interrupt it, but... There we go. And a gremlin. I think Jaws taken over that? Yeah. Since cheese out and about. Of course, apparently Jaws isn't that good at it either. <laughs> I'm just joking. She had many rounds as well where she got just one, so... Thing is, that thing's out of like a horror film. Uh, I think this is a second cat. Yep, we'll do his thought right now. Uh, we do have to lock in sculptures unless we do have a bonus stack in here. Hopefully, we do. Let's find out. Uh, delighted it's about to leave too. Mm. Tough, 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 tough. Hmm. Secret body suppression. I wonder if this is actually good, though. You know? Like, I wonder... I mean, if... If he's able to stop the artifacts from hitting him... The physical cultivators would be really strong at that point. I'm assuming they can only... Snatch one at a time or something. Right? I mean... Of course. Uh, okay, good. So we did get a new thing for Delighted. So that's been uh, refreshed-ish. Um, that just means that we're going to have to think on it next round. So and we're not getting the red stuff that we need. So the main issue remains with second cat. He's not getting what he needs. Um, well, thinking on it's better than not, so... Here we go. Good luck, second cat. Okay. All right. Uh, we'll we'll continue the game until uh, the flood dragon comes, and then uh, we'll look to close it up here. I think that's a pretty good uh, cliffhanger for the episode. Looking for Lunar Frost, I'm pretty sure. Uh, 
Uh, BE can actually fight this this guy, the Thunder Dragon, too. But I don't think we'll. I don't think we'll need any help, honestly, outside of Tanetta. I think even that's going to be a little bit too much damage, maybe. Starting to wonder if I should even cut down another artifact, really. Or replace some of her needles with earth artifacts. Like, these needles would probably be a good idea. Make sure trees are well fed. I wonder, are all of these items the same types? So these Serenity Soul Gems are Soul Gems. Tier 8. What about the Spirit Soul Gems? Is, is that the same? Wait, this guy's leaving? Whoa. I didn't know that they could just leave. He eventually gave up? That's the first time I've ever see, seen that. He's like, oh, okay, well, you're not gonna, you're gonna tolerate me. I guess I'll just leave. This guy's kind of a monster. Uh, <laughs> how is he just able to walk away from that? He's supposed to be praying right here to die. Hmm. This guy's defied all logic. And he's a turtle, too. Why is he not, like, hungry or thirsty? What is up with this guy? He's tired, but... I mean... I would be too after a day of prayer without food or water. Respect. Respect to that turtle. Alright. Let's open this really quick before we... Uh, Close the episode here too. Um, just trying to wrap up as many things as I can think to. Before this flood dragon gets here. I think we're good though. I think we're good. Uh, we won't have the Flood Dragon out this time to resolve the cold spots. So we're gonna have to make sure that we, you know, set up like right here and right here. Maybe right here or something. Out of areas where people are trying to sit and concentrate on stuff, obviously. I can't I, actually I don't remember. I think it's the 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 claws are immune, right? Yeah, rage mode focuses on its core and the other parts weaken. Yeah, we have to break the claws first. Yep. Yep, break the claws first. That's what I thought it was. that is where we'll end the episode so i hope you enjoy it as always uh next episode obviously you know what we're doing already but um we'll continue to cultivate continue to grow the sect uh look to challenge the other sect soon uh if there is something else that you would like to see in the game though or in the taiyi sect that is feel free to drop a comment in and i will consider it until next time though peace